Hey guys, so today's video uh, for hashtag lead people is a original organizing tips video. <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, sorry about my shadow because right now I'm in my room. Um, so this has been always my main focus of my room because I've always had trouble coming up with new ideas, how organizing and making it more efficient. Uh, so this is kind of what it looks like right now. Um, so originally I had just all this kind of like stacked up on boxes. And I was like, you know what? Time for change. Can't have this stacked the boxes forever. So I kind of went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I saw a couple of these in the funny looking nails thingies. <laughs> I don't know what you call them. And then anyway, I was like, you know what? This is brilliant. I'm going to get it. And I've had all this stuff here ever since. Um, not very original. Yes, I know. Uh, but this is. See, in here... I keep all my makeup stuff very, very, you can see I have four here. Now this is original. See, this is not meant to contain makeup and other stuff. But it's a very good organizer, it's very compact, very easy to open and close. I can't do it one-handed, but, um, hold on. You see, you just kind of put it up like that, and then you can push it down. So it's very easy to use, and it holds a lot, and... It helps keep things organized and stuff like that. And you can fit four in a little corner here. And so yeah, it kind of worked out perfectly. And these are actually lemon container things. For people that don't know, uh, I drink uh, Crystal Light Lemonade and they come in packets. And the packets come in these kind of containers and so when they're done, I bring it up here and I kind of use it for that. So that is one b brilliant thing I came up for organization. Also is this. This is a makeup bag. But I don't use it for makeup. See, it has a mechanical opening thing. What I do is I, if you open this up and you look inside, you'll see I have like hair clips and hair things and uh, um, things for the Q-tips and that kind of stuff. So I don't really use it for makeup really, per se, but I do use it for like um, just my hair things. Because my hair gets disgusting and my bangs kind of fold in on themselves sometimes. So, uh, that's extremely, extremely helpful, oops, for when that happens. Um, so yeah, that is the other thing I use for organization. Now, the next thing I have for organization is, uh, if you're like me, you have a lot of papers. So I use one of these little, um, thing, like those filing cabinet opening boxes. Um, just to keep my papers always, and it's so, so helpful. You stick all the papers that you don't need to look at right now, and you just put them in there, and you're good. <laughs> um, it's not really organized, per se, but it's a good way to kind of know where your stuff is. Um, I also keep some papers in here. Um, just, like, receipts and stuff like that. And I also keep, um, receipts in here, which is my, uh, iPod case that came in when I was younger. And I keep some extra change in here um, because it's easy you know, to open and close. Uh, it's a box I got from Hershey, Pennsylvania. Not really, really anything major. I keep some like extra little hair ties and stuff in here. There's nothing in here right now. There's a bag that I don't really. No, it's a paper, paper. But I keep what well, like little extra things I keep in here. These are like eggs from my, from at Easter, but they're really helpful. Or Ziploc bags like this where I keep my um. The beach necessities. I also have this little um thing from Pennsylvania where I keep my money that I don't not that I don't want to keep in my wallet just for uh, extra money on the side. I still have money, so I, I kind of know where all my money is. It's kind of like my own bank in a way. <laughs> I keep half money in the bank, half some money here, half some money in my wallet. That way, I always. Ha don't have to keep going to the bank to get more money, but I don't have all my money in the wallet, so I don't spend all of it. <laughs> I also have this little bag from that I got when I bought my laptop that I use just in case. So yeah, anyway, that was that. Then if you go to my other bedroom, this is where all the fun organization really happens. I got this from um. Also from Bed Bath & Beyond, it is genius. I have so many, 
so much jewelry, it's not even funny. And it's so much better than these plain old jewelry boxes. So if I would recommend going back to the end, they have a lot of great organization stuff. Not really original either, but <laughs> um, yeah. I have this, which is kind of original. It keeps all my Q-tips and it came with my perfume bag. Yeah. Nothing too exciting there. And uh, speaking of which, I also, for you guys, if you remember the boxes I showed you in my other room, I have them here for my shoes. It's great for keeping track of all my shoes because I have a lot of them. Not a lot of some people, but I still have a lot. And then over here, I have this really cool thing. It's for belts and scarves, and it's in shape of the owl. It's really great for looking at your scarves at once and kind of just knowing what you want. So, uh, yeah, it's not too anything too exciting. Uh, <laughs> but it does get the job done. Um, so this is really, really, really short vlog. This is the last thing on my list. And this is not original either, but this is my handed in the portfolio thing. And pretty much what I do is I have all the papers that I need here. And I keep them here for safekeeping. And they have a little handle so that if you ever need to take it with you somewhere, you can just hold it like this and you're good to go. Um, so yeah, and I keep it on the side of my bookshelf. Anyway, uh, that is pretty much it. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of books here as well. Um, and I have my suitcases here. Now, why do I keep these suitcases? Uh, in case you guys haven't been around for the last century or so, we've had like literally two main uh, um, hurricanes in the New York area, and then we had a couple down a little bit further down. Um, but yeah, anyway, I have a lot of things that are really, really precious to me. I have a Mentos drawer, in case you can see that black drawer, and that green box, they're Mentos. Uh, there's so much stuff in there, I wouldn't. Take me forever to take a bit, make a video, so I'm not sure if I should make one or not. I may end up making one, doing them in part. I don't know. I'll see. Um, but it takes too long, so I'll do it at another date and time. Um, as well as as you see, I have a lot of books, so I'll do maybe one of those as well. Um, I'm gonna go through. I have a lot of uh, stuff, so I'm thinking about making my books collection, vlogs, my. Mentos books, my clothes, my like everything. I'm thinking of making like vlogs, a big major haul, showing you everything I have pretty much. Uh, but it would take forever so to do in parts, so not right now. Uh, but yeah, as you see, I have a lot of stuff. <laughs> so I keep these suitcases here just in case anything major happens. I just pack everything up and go away. Uh, I'm not really materialistic, but everything I have has a lot of memories and stuff like that, so I don't want to lose it. So yeah, especially things like this clock. <laughs> which I've had since I was a little baby and it still means a lot to me. So yeah, every, I keep mostly everything that is important to me in this room just so I can kind of pack everything up and go. Um, the things I say are from the other room, they're in drawers or they're in boxes so I can just carry them into the car if I need to. Um, so yeah, um, as I said, I have a lot of things that are important to me. So I will be making haul videos in the nearby future one step at a time in parts just so I won't overwhelm everybody with the amount of stuff I have. Cause I mean, not, there's not like a lot like some people have, but it is a lot. So uh, <laughs> I don't want to overwhelm you. So uh, but we'll see. But if you guys have any suggestions, tips, recommendations, or requests, comment in the comments down below. Link any videos I have that are similar to these videos that I'm making in the recent updates. Uh, if you have, you want me to review any of your videos or vlogs or you in general. Oh, I do YouTube reviews and product reviews every Thursday. Um, so if you guys want me to do it, just link your videos in the comments down below or inbox me and I will definitely check them out. Um, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out all my vlogs. And plus I have a lot of more fun, detailed vlogs, hauls, etc. Unboxings coming up in the future. And I also have a Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. So make sure to check me out on those. They are all under the same name, Victoria Safe. Or something similar. <laughs> um, anyway, and don't forget to check out all my other vlogs because they're really, really fun. I can't not wait to get down to the rest of the stuff I have that I've been keeping secret. I have so many surprises in store and I cannot wait to get, tell you guys about them. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to show up now. Um, 